Yo, what's up everybody? Today, I'm going to be showing you my two homemade puppets I made. Um, the first one was pretty hard. Um, I tried copying it from Don't Hook Me, I'm Scared. And the second one is small. Uh, he's like, actually small. And I'll show you my first one. First, of course. Well, this is my first puppet. His name's Dan. His name is Dan. And then he has like a stick here to move his arm. And he has like a little pocket here. And his blue hair. It doesn't really do anything. Oh, it does. You just put your hand through here or through here if you want to move his mouth. Is it that? So, and his eyes are foam. They're foam balls. And then I just put some black piece of cardboard there. And his nose is a foam ball as well. And so I use cardboard. And for his head, is plastic. His head, he has something plastic, hard plastic in there. And This is Dan. Um, and now, this is my second puppet. Um, he's small. He looks weird, but I'm gonna fix him up. I'm gonna fix him, do some stuff on him, and so I can make his body look better. But I use some straws so he can like, so you can bend his arms like this. Any direction you want to. And his body, his arms are straws, his legs are straws. His head is a foam head, is a foam ball, same as Dan, his eyes. And I just cut it in inside of the ball. And then just took that out, heat up a knife, and then clean the inside. And then I just got a popsicle stick, stabbed it through the back of his head, and put it so it could go to his mouth. And then glued that so it could, so it could like, move. See? So this is little Bob. Hey, how are you doing? Hey! And um, tell me, leave me a subscription below. Um, what kind of, what kind of name? Um, leave, a, leave a subscription below. Um, how should I dress him up? Should I, should I give him a big body? Should I give him a small body? What color of clothes should I give him? And. Yeah, like and subscribe, and see you guys later.